hi everyone thank you guys for tuning in today i started a new youtube channel so feel free to visit click on this link and you can visit my youtube channel and see all the videos that i'm going to be posting i promised i was going to be back talking to you today about encouraging yourself and the lord do you know that there's going to be times in your life where you will be facing a circumstance and just don't know who to turn to where you could be dealing with something and you're like looking for encouragement like you need to you want to talk to your friends but they're not available you want to talk to your parents they're not there maybe your spouse may not understand and you're just like oh my god how do i get myself out of this rut well today i want to tell you about a man you probably already know who i'm talking about yeah i'm talking about david where you know he was in this their circumstance you know he and his men that had gone out to fight with him and he was in a place where his wife and their cattle and everything they had was taken away by the enemy and the bible says that david encouraged himself in the lord i always often wonder what does it mean to encourage yourself in the lord i can tell you what i think it means and how it's worked out for me when I want to encourage myself in the Lord, I think about all the things he has done for me before. I think about the battles he has fought for me before. I am very sure that David sat and thought about the incident with Goliath. He thought about when he fought the bear and he fought the lion. He thought about all of that and God was magnified in his mind. So much so he was encouraged to know that the same God that was with him, that defeated Goliath, that fought the bear, that fought the lion, will be the one that would give him, you know, direction and be with him as he pursues the enemy to get all that, to recover all that was stolen. Sometimes you may not have the people around you that you need because when something happens, it's human nature to immediately pick up the phone and want to narrate everything. But look, God will take you away from the closest of people to put you in a place where you depend on him and depend on him alone so that when trouble hits, you would encourage yourself in the Lord. You would think about his might. You would exalt him above your circumstances and you will be encouraged. I hope this has blessed somebody today. I always say this and I'll continue to say it, that leaving is a privilege. So make the most out of it. God bless you.